Uh, right now, the busiest travel day of the year. It's kind of winding down a little bit. Millions of Americans headed home for the holiday uh, the, after the Thanksgiving holiday. NBC 5's Courtney Sisk shares how travel impacted the air, roads, and the tracks this weekend. Sunday marked a busy travel day at both of Chicago's airports, the Expressway and the Amtrak as people wrapped up their Thanksgiving travel. And we also added some snow into the mix, but most travelers we spoke to said they fared well. Our mission today is get people over the river, through the woods, back from grandma's house to work or school or family. On the busiest travel day of the season so far. It's been actually smooth, actually. No problems, no issues, so it's been actually smooth. Travelers have been pleasantly surprised. Airline officials say 300,000 people went through both Chicago airports Sunday after holiday fun. We went to Disney Magic Kingdom. An Epcot. It was actually really good and really smooth, so pretty happy about that. And while the crowds made their way through the airports, most passengers we spoke to said they didn't deal with the typical travel chaos, with the average delay at O'Hare totaling 20 minutes Sunday. Honestly, not bad. We flew out uh, Tuesday night, which I think was kind of nice. I think Wednesday could have been more hectic. And then coming back today was fine. I was worried about the snow, but no issues. And the bustle didn't stop there. This is our busiest day of the year. We'll have a, more than 11,000 Amtrak customers through our station today. That's about four times a normal Sunday. Amtrak riders also filling into the station Sunday. Well, AAA estimates 2.4 million people drove to their Thanksgiving destinations. Hope you guys enjoy your holidays and have fun. Reporting at O'Hare, Courtney Sisk, NBC5 News.